I'm David Tillman, author of NootropicsExpert.com, and in this video I'm going to share with you what I know about cat's claw, what it is, why we use it, the science behind it, dosage, and possible side effects. Cat's claw is a large woody South American vine that gets its name from the hook-like thorns on the leaf stem resembling the claws of a cat. Cat's claw is indigenous to the, to the Amazon rainforest and other tropical areas of South and Central America. Cat's claw has been used uh, medicinally by the Agorana, Ashinika, Kashibo, Kanibo, and Shipido, Shipibo tribes of Peru for at least 2,000 years. The Ashinika use cat's claw for everything from asthma to urinary tract infections to cancer. Now, I won't go into a long list of the ailments cat's claw is used for here because we're focused on the cognitive benefits of this herb. But just rest assured, cat's claw is an amazing track record. Now, most of the commercially grown cat's claw we get for uh, nootropic use is from Peru. Cat's claw is rich in phytochemicals, alkaloids, uh, glycosides, tannins, flavonoids, sterile fractions, and other compounds. But ignore the marketing hype of good alkaloids and bad alkaloids and TAO-free cat's claw. Independent research since the early 1970s in animals and humans have used everything from freeze-dried ground root and bark to individual extracts of uh, specific cat's claw compounds. Cat's claw has been shown to decrease inflammation of arthritis, prevent DNA damage, reduce free radical damage, reduce cancer, controls pain through serotonin receptors, and much more. But how specifically does cat's claw work in the brain? Well, a couple of things really stand out. First, cat's claw is a neuroprotectant. Cat's claw and its extracts have long been used to treat arthritis, asthma, chronic inflammation, immune disorders, pain, wound healing, tumors. Some of the more recent research is focused on the cognitive benefits of cat's claw and using it to protect brain function and cognition. Now one study demonstrated an extract of cat's claw could enhance DNA repair in the brain. Another study showed cat's claw uh, was boosting tryptophan levels, which could have a profound effect on serotonin and mood. Dozens of other studies show cat's claw possessing antioxidant properties, anti-inflammatory and immune modulator, anti-tumor, antihypertensive, as well as prevention of stroke. The second way is cat's claw um, can, increase, uh, can increase learning and memory. In fact, extracts of this herb can help learning and memory in healthy as well as damaged brains. Research shows certain alkaloid extracts of cat's claw can help repair brain cell damage by stroke or dysfunction of the acetylcholine receptors. The cat's claw alkaloid rincophylline is an NMDA antagonist, selectively restricting NMDA receptor receptors, helps tone down hyperactivity and overstimulation, providing a calm mind for clear cognition and learning. Now here we're talking about um, primarily stress and uh, cat's claw's applications to it. Chronic stress, anxiety, and free radicals or oxidation damage your brain. There's no question about it. This damage can manifest in several ways, including memory loss, brain fog, anxiety, uh, depression, and diseases like Alzheimer's and Parkinson's. Now, under conditions of chronic stress or depression caused by just everyday living or even chronic pain, your brain loses the capacity to transmit signals between neurons effic efficiently. Memory, cognition, and decision-making all suffer as a result. Now this is where cat's claw comes to the rescue. Research from hundreds of studies have shown that cat's claw and its extracts are potent antioxidant and anti-inflammatories. It relieves pain through influence on serotonin receptors. It enhances DNA repair. It boosts uh, immune health. It uh, suppresses tumor proliferation protects against damage from stroke, 
in, improves uh, memory and cognition, restores the availability of acetylcholine, improves cerebral circulation, reduces stress, helps repair brain cells, eliminates free radicals from within brain cells. That's a pretty amazing list. But how does cat's claw actually feel when you take it as a supplement? Well, it's a potent anti-inflammatory and immune booster. So most neurohackers report a dramatic decrease in arthritis and joint pain. Great side benefit. Cat's claw has a reputation for reducing the symptoms of Lyme disease and Crohn's disease. Most who use cat's claw regularly report they don't get sick as often. They experience less pain and have an easier time getting to sleep and sleeping through the night. Now, some neurohackers use uh, cat's claw to relieve an overactive mind. Cat's claw can calm racing thoughts and make it easier to focus. And we've got a ton of research backing this all up. Cat's claw improves memory. Um, I'll give you one example here. Cat's claw has been reported to restore memory both in the lab and in user reviews. Uh, one method of increase in memory with cat's claw may be through promoting long-term potentiation. Now, the alkaloid I mentioned before, rincophilin, is uh, when it's isolated from cat's claw, it's long been recommended for the treatment of disease uh, of the central nervous system. Now, researchers in China investigated using it in stroke victims. Rats were injected with rincophilin once daily for four consecutive days before surgery, and then one more injection after surgery. And this just reminds me of why I'm glad I'm not a lab rat. The surgery created a stroke in the rats by severing the middle artery in their brain. The team found that rincophiline prevented brain damage from the stroke while increasing BDNF expression, or brain-derived nootropic factor. The cat claw extract also activated the signaling pathway, which is the necessary component of long-term potentiation. Now, as you know, long-term potentiation is a strengthening of the syn uh, synapses between neurons, which is one of the major mechanisms uh, in the brain behind learning and memory. Uh, we also have uh, clinical studies on how cat's claw suppresses cancer and um, how cat's claw repairs DNA and boosts the immune system. For more details on these uh, clinical studies, please go to Nootropic Sex where you can search for cat's claw and all the links to the research are on there. So how do you dose cat's claw? Well, it's well tolerated um, by most and considered non-toxic. It's available in tablets, capsules, or as a water or alcohol extract tincture. Ground or freeze-dried cat's claw bark can also be taken as a tea. Cat's claw recommended dosage is one 100 milligram capsule per day for arthritis and one 250 or 350 milligram capsule per day for cognitive and immune support. Standardized cat's claw um, or um, root bark extracts usually contain 3% alkaloids and 15% phenols. Don't mistake Ancaria tomentosa for Ancaria guinengesis, which is another type of cat's claw from the Amazon bus. Ancario guinensis is the way it's pronounced, um, has a much lower alkaloid content. So look for Ancario tomentosa. Side effects are rare with cat claw, but they may include um, diarrhea, dizzy, nauseaness, um, those with immune diseases, skin grafts, tuberculosis, or receiving organ transplants shouldn't use cat's claw because of its effects on the immune system. Cat's claw can stimulate the immune system and will counteract any medication you're using to suppress your immune system. Cat's claw is known for lowering blood pressure. So if you have an issue with blood, low blood pressure or you're on high blood pressure medication, you should not use cat's claw. Cat's claw may increase the risk of bleeding, so don't take this herb if you have a bleeding disorder or you're on blood thinners or just before surgery. Um, as for available forms, cat's claw powdered um, uh, bark of the vine is usually the least expensive form 
and it comes in 1,000 milligram capsules. Cat's Claw standardized extract usually contains 1.5% to 3% oxindoil uh, alkaloids and 15% phenols. AC11 and uh, ORC CMAD100 is a patented hot water extract of Cat's Claw and it's standardized to 8% carboxyl alkyl esters. And finally, there's Sevintaro, POA Cat's Claw, is a standardized and patented form of Cat's Claw with 1.3% pentacilic oxindol alkaloids, or POAs, at um, 260 micrograms, and it's purified to be free of tetracyclic oxindol alkaloids, or TOAs. So my nootropics are expert recommendation for Cat's Claw standardized extract up to 250 to 300 milligrams per day. And that's my report on Cat's Claw. If you want to see links to the studies I talked about, go to nootropicsexpert.com and search for Cat's Claw. Or click on the link below this video. You'll find a full transcript of this video and you'll find dozens of articles and all the well-known nootropics on Nootropics Expert. If you have any questions or you want to share your experience using Cat's Claw, go to my article at nootropicsexpert.com and leave it in the comments section at the bottom of the article. If you want to see more videos on all the popular nootropics used today, subscribe to this channel before you leave. I'll be putting up new videos on nootropics and optimizing your brain every week. I'm David Toman, author of Nootropics Expert.